what is all the commotion about? You girls are out here. Oh, give me my coffee. I tell you what. Waddles is out here crowing his butt off. Yeah, he is. Why are you still running away from me? You've been here over a year. You know I ain't going to hurt you. But you're still silly. I'm going to get you. Oh, I'm going to get you. Come here. Oh, wow. Ha, <laughs> ha. She's full of silly. She's not scared. Oh, I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Look at her. Is that the same Melly that showed up a year ago? No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> we're going to get a Melly. Yeah, we're going to get us a Melly. A silly Melly. And do you know why they're silly? Especially this one. This one's always silly. Because it's 50 degrees. 50. Look, I got a sweatshirt on. It was worthy of making a video. Early morning one. And this guy is out here making a ton of noise. Yeah, you are. Look at him. What is the issue, Waddles? Huh? Why are you out here making all this crowing and all this noise? Look at you. Your hair's messed up, everything. And you got your your hens out here. They're a mess. Ooh, listen to that bird. That's a hee <laughs> bird. Say it again, dude. All right. There's my scoop. Good morning. I gotta feed these guys. They're they're up complaining. I'm going to tease them a little bit. Waddles. Tick, 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 tick. Look at him. He ain't letting nobody have nothing this morning. He's running them off. Waddles. You be nice. <laughs> he still acts like he may not be able to walk like a normal rooster, but he acts like a normal rooster. All right, let's get this video going, man. I ain't got all day. All right, welcome to the channel. 50 degrees, man, I don't know how to deal with that. Uh, I took advantage of it. I had some wasps over in the corner of the dog yard. We'll go over there and look at them. And I didn't have any wasp spray. I got stung. Two times yesterday mowing and then the day before I got stung two times uh, I had some Vienna sausage uh, cans that I flipped upside down for whatever reason and hung them on the fence post well wasp love that kind of thing they built nest in there and I didn't have any wasp spray so I went in there this morning with Lysol 50 degrees you gotta take advantage of that yeah, they weren't up and about. Sprayed that up in there, knocked them cans off. Ain't got no wasp no more. Oh man, look at this thing. I have been dealing with that bush for five years. I cut it down, and every year it comes back. <sighs> All right. I got my coffee. I don't want to spill it. That's another story, the coffee. Here they are. Let me see if they're they're probably mad. Yeah, they're not coming out in 50 degrees. Lysol. Oh man, it didn't even kill them. They're still in there. Let me fix them. Get out of here. That's right. My name's Dog Man, not Wasp Man. I will kill some wasps. Oh, so last night, my refrigerator died. Freezer, everything in the freezer, trash. 
Now I got to go in there and throw out everything else. The mayonnaise, the, the whatever, whatever's in there. Horseradish, jalapenos. So I got to throw everything in my refrigerator out. But, you know, I've had that refrigerator 10 years. And it's probably at least 10 years older than that. So now, now I got to go buy a Chinese made piece of crap. It's only going to last two years. I'll tell you. We don't have a refrigerator to keep your hot dogs cold. So I got to go get one tomorrow. That's setting us back. I'm going to have to cut back on you guys' treats. Yeah, I'm going to have to cut back on your treats. Yeah, your your friend dogs, they're, they're, they're complaining. Uh, but that ain't the end of it. I drink instant coffee, so I put water in the cup, put it in the microwave for three minutes. I come back. The water's ice cold, so it broke. So now I got to get a new microwave too. Now that microwave is only about five years old. Uh, I should have kept that giant one from 1977, but no, I threw it out. Never throw out old appliances, man. Now let's go look at the garden. Look at that pepper. Ooh. It's like a velvet red and this thing I only planted one pepper bush habaneros it just keeps putting them out it does not stop them things are beautiful but we had a big storm come through the other morning it blew everything crazily crazily is that even a word look at them they're a mess I'm leaving them alone they're lucky they're even still living. I was going to pull them up last week. But as you can see, I've got another harvest coming. It's just like overnight. It went boom. Look at this. Where did you come from? Man, that's ready to eat, man. I've got peppers galore on these. But yet the ghost peppers, nope, nothing nothing's on them I don't know let's come around here I mean these man they are I've got tomatoes on every plant almost so we're gonna get one more harvest out of these that's good it's just good it ain't today cuz I got nowhere to put them all right and this is why I don't I'm not gonna grow okra anymore because I never harvest it. Look at that, just went to waste. I don't even like okra. Why do I grow it? The only way okra is good is if you fry it. And I'm not eating fried foods anymore. That's some good looking okra though, ain't it Tilly? What do you think of these 50 degree temperatures? Huh? What do you think of them? Where's Millie? Oh, where is she? There she is. We'll go see Millie. Oh, this feels good out here. 50 degrees. Millie, can we come over to your area? She don't care. There comes the sun. Woo! What are you doing? There's Miss Millie. What you doing? Yeah, you're afraid of the camera. Because if I was out here, you wouldn't be doing that. All right, come here. We're going to come up here. We're going to have some coffee. Look at this one. Tilly is definitely the goofball of the bunch. But she's not far behind. Come here, Millie. You come see me. Come here. Yeah, oh, well, here she comes. Good girls, give me some heads. Give me some heads. When I say that, the Millie's always got to stick her head in there. Get some petting. Yeah. Where are you at? You're a pet hog. That's what you are, a big old pet hog. 
your ears are freezing. What are you going to do with those freezing ears? Give me that ear. I'm going to put it in my pocket. You only have one ear now. One ear. What are you going to do with one ear? What are you going to do? Look at her. She actually thinks I got her ear. It's my ear. No, that's my ear. You're not going to. I'm going to put it on my head. She thinks I got her ear. All right, give me that nose. I got your nose now. You don't got an ear, and you're missing a nose. So you can't put your nose in nobody's business no more. All right, come here. I want to give him back. Ooh, you got your nose and ear back. Yep. You guys think that something you do with babies, but it really works with dogs. Hey, Millie, can I get your ear? Can I get your ear? Let me see your head. Come here. She's not going to fall for it. <laughs> Come here. Come here. I, got, I, want, I want to pet your head. <laughs> I'm going to get you. Look at that girl. A year ago, she showed up scared to death. Well, she's still scared to death. But it ain't as bad. Oh. Yeah, now you're just silly. A year ago, you were really scared. Now you're just silly. Look at her. What is she, what is she doing? You were kind of scared when you showed up. I got that ear again. Got it again. I threw it away. You are a goofball. I'm going to get you. And then I'm going to make a post and tell everybody to get you. Everybody to get you. What do you think of this 50 degrees? Oh. That means I got to get out of here and start cutting some weeds, man. And I think I'm going to make a trip this morning to Oklahoma. I haven't been there in a few months. And then come back and maybe do some work. I don't know. It's Sunday. So if I don't want to work, I got an excuse. It's the day of rest. Might do that. Why are you two girls constantly itching on your back? You got Soresto collars. You ain't got no bugs. Where's the other goofball? There she is. Melly. Yeah, Waddles. What are you doing? You are scared of your own shadow. Yeah. She's never really going to get that out of her. Any kind of a sudden movement. You know, she's jumping. Come here. But I can get her over to pet. Come here. You goofball, come here. Come here. Give me some heads. That's all I got to say. Give me some heads. And she, she comes over there. She cannot stand to see Tilly getting her head petted without getting yours petted. Ooh, give me that ear. I'm, I got that ear. I got Melly's ear. I'm going to put it on Tilly. Get her, Tilly. Get her. You got Melly's ear. Yeah. Just a goofy video, guys. Ain't got no... Doesn't make no sense. I'm just putting one up. Get her. Get her, get her, Kelly. Everybody likes a Sunday morning with puppy dogs and a silly rooster. Right. Where's my coffee? Let's get it and walk. That's right. Yeah, because Monday, well, that's tomorrow. I'm starting back my walking. And I got to get these trails cut. But I got to put the, all right, Waddles, I got to put the blade back on the weed eater because this year I have this ragweed. And this stuff is, you can't knock that down with string. It's tough. Or I may just let it wait, you know, wait until it dies and then uh, burn it. But in here, nothing grew all summer. That's. <laughs> 
That's weird. And I'm not filming me walking this time. That, that takes away from just getting down to it, you know. Gotta get rid of this tree. Ugh. And the worst part we're walking up on now. For the first time in 10 years. I don't know what happened. We had a storm like in i don't know june and it blew all this stuff this way to the east and the dog cemetery disappeared so i gotta get in here and cut all that back i need to go buy some uh like some sheer uh hedge clippers man look at this stuff there's the graves down there so I gotta get this taken care of. And I gotta get Libby's headstone put on her grave. Man, it's just, I never let it get this bad. Can't even read Wally's, it's covered in leaves. All right. It feels so good out here. Look at that goofy Melly. Melly, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm gonna watch Tilly. She'll get so worked up. I'm gonna get you. I'm coming to get you, Mel Tilly. I'm coming to get you. You know I am. You know I am. I'm gonna get you. Oh. oh. <laughs> Here she goes. I know how to work her up. Your ears inside out. I'm gonna get it. Cause that's when you get in here, when they're going inside out. Oh, you goofball, you're not even getting playful. Where's Millie? Yeah, I complained and moaned and when these two dogs showed up, I didn't want to have to take care of anymore and I'm so glad they stayed. <laughs> you didn't hear me? Don't get a big head over it. All right, let me come in here. You gotta watch for copperheads, they're bad. This time of year. What you doing, Melly? You're just gonna stand by that tree? Oh, come. You're as goofy as they make them. There you are. Where's Tilly? <laughs> There's Tilly. Oh, you're silly. You are so silly. Tilly wants to play. We'll play in a little bit. That goofball wants to play too. They just sit around and listen to all the morning noises. The chickens and the birds. Good coffee right there. Wonder how many how many of you guys are still watching this stupid video. That's been there for five years. It, at some point you would think. I'd pick that up and throw it in the trash. But nope, I hadn't done it. That's been there five years. At some point you would have thought I would have picked that up. Threw it in the trash. Nope. Nothing like waking up in the morning, coming out, and this is in your backyard, guys. And you. 
sit in that chair. But it appears if I sit in that chair, I'm going to have some uncomfortable feeling on my bottom. And I can't sit on that, it'll break. Come here, Millie. Come here. What's them crows all upset about, Millie? You got the Tweedledirk birds, they're over on the other side. <laughs> she always, she gives you that look. Yeah, you do. She's a good girl. Yeah, she's a good baby girl. We love the telly. We do. Look here, Melly. I'm petting. Melly. I'm petting some heads. Look here. You're not getting in on this. You don't care. You gotta watch this girl. She can pull off some goofy things. Yep. And if she wants a treat, now her new thing is. She goes to that screen patio door and just starts going nuts, barking at me until I come out and telling her to hush, don't, don't work. She keeps, she knows if she keeps it up, she'll get a milk bone or she'll get a bacon treat or whatever. They manipulate you, man. That's what they do. Come here, Millie. What are you doing? You're silly. There you are. I don't know why you act like you do. Listen here, crows. Go bug somebody. Go over to Jeff's house. Go over to Jeff's house and start that crowing. I don't need you. <laughs> I bet you there's some of you still watching. It ain't really, this video don't make no sense. I'll see the chickens again. We got nothing else to do. Waddles, I told you yesterday, come out here and pick all this stuff that the wind blew up, but you don't listen to me. Who in their right mind would keep a bird like him? Miss Broody. We think Waddles. Well, that's what I say. You're fixing a crow, ain't you? Cool enough, you guys could start eating that corn. Yep. I just looked at the GoPro. 26 minutes. I gotta get off here. Hey, if I can make a dollar on this video, I know it is a perfect world and anything's possible because this video sucks. Alright, guys, I'm gonna take a trip to Oklahoma this morning. And I can't buy a refrigerator till tomorrow. I have I haven't done a review on the one that I have. It's a little uh, cooler 
refrigerator you'll see a review on that this week but I'm glad I got it because now I don't have to throw everything out all right we're gonna go in put this on YouTube so you guys have some prime entertainment for Sunday morning if you, if you call this prime entertainment you guys got issues happy trails